I find myself getting stuck in thought mode a lot of times. I'm looking to overcome this and my nail biting habit. Yeah, so as soon as you can catch it, this is great. Like you find yourself getting stuck in thought mode. So a lot of times you'll be stuck in thought mode and, and don't even notice it. You won't find yourself there because you, you'll come up with all these reasons, right? If we use Posh as an example, right? And listen, Posh, we've all been there, right? You, you're, you'll get stuck in the, how do I get started and who do I have on and what do I talk about and what time should I go live and does it fit into my calendar and how do I record and what room should I use? What should my background be? And you know, all of this stuff, right? You don't even notice that you're stuck in thought mode. You just live there so often that you don't even notice that you're stuck in thought mode. But you, when you said, I find myself getting stuck in thought mode, that's when you have to start taking action. That's when you have to start doing something to no longer accept thought mode as, a, as an acceptable reason for you not to do the thing that you want to do. So you may still land there by default. That's normal. But as soon as it becomes subconscious to conscious, as soon as you can find, you actually catch yourself, now, you have, now this is where we start to shift identity. That now you become the person who follows through. You show yourself that you follow through.